What's up, people? It's your boy Jato. I'm here today in Kerbal Space Program, and today we're just roving around in our everyday little driver, daily driver rover that uh, is pretty sweet, pretty compact, except for where we want to fly. So we're going to stop that real quick. And let's just go ahead and get the whole flying conversion out of the way. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's hit play. And here you go. There's a lot going on in here. So pay close attention. <laughs> let's show you that one more time here. Let's play it in reverse. And you'll see everything gets stowed away, packed away, compressed, and it's back to a regular rover. But let's get ready to fly and have some fun with this. Everything comes out, folds back, ready for flight. Roll that intro. So if you're seeing this now and you're hearing my voice, I am finally healthy. <laughs> uh, finally recovered from my Tdap shot. I had a really big knot on my shoulder. It was so solid. It's still kind of sore, but really bad reaction to the Tdap shot. And I had to have that because I'm having a child soon. So I had to get that shot to the shoulder. But the problem is I tensed up because I hate needles. So if you tense up, that's bad because that will cause that to happen. And I also ended up getting a, a really bad fever that lasted uh, about two or three days and just feeling lightheaded. It was horrible, horrible. Anyhow, I'm back, I'm healthy, and hopefully you guys are back and healthy too. Hopefully you will enjoy this video. This is also a VTOL craft. So let's go ahead and start spinning her on up. You see already it's ready to lift off does not take very much to get this bird off the ground. Let's go to 3.3, roll 3.4 even. And here you go, we are, we are mobile, we are flying. We can also keep going forward and what this is gonna do once you hit four, it's gonna start angling them forward a little bit for you. This is going to allow you to then get some forward velocity going you are going to have to counter it a little bit because it's not balanced out for flying like that. It's balanced out to be a rover. But anyhow, it can fly and it can do it fairly well. So we're just going to fly on over to the VAB. We just dropped some stuff off at comms real quick. All right, let's swing back around. So we're just going to swing her back around real quickly. And then come here, Whoa. and we're going to start lowering our blade pitch down because we need to get back down to 3.1 so we can start coming down for a landing. All right, so let's go ahead and nose up, drop down to 2.8, we should still start come down. All right, so now we're slowed down enough so we can go back to our 3.1. And we're going to come in for a nice gentle landing, a little 3.2 to bring us a little further. All right, looking good. And this is a flying converting rover. This is what I would like to see in traffic one day. This would be a beautiful thing to see. I'm just going to keep coming down because we can take a pretty decent impact. It is a bit spongy, it's okay. We can actually deliver our Kerbal right up to the doorway here. And we're good, lower it on down, start rolling forward. And we can then come up here and we're just gonna, it's like say we had a Kerbal we needed to drop off here. We can now drop our Kerbal off right here boom all right you get out and you you go to your rock and you go to Duna you do good things for us but now we're done let's go ahead and reverse well 
it looks like the reverse isn't working today. <laughs> so in that case, we're just gonna fly. All right, so let's get it. Let's get into the air. All right, here we go. 3.1, 3.2, 3.3, airborne, and we're out of here. And we can just whip it around, whip it good. All right, there you go. And now we can just kind of fly above above traffic and the rest of the world. We don't have to sit back and engage with anyone on the highway. This would be the way to go because I would absolutely just love to be able to, oh, there's a traffic accident. And then just them flash a flying sign. If you're permitted to fly, go ahead and convert your vehicles and fly over the traffic accident to clear up traffic. And all of a sudden you just, and everybody just starts flying off. Oh, that would be so awesome. Oh my God. Wow, we're coming on skirting just above everything here. This one is a monster. <laughs> I absolutely love that. It was just like barely above the, the runway, the landing pad. Here we go. We're gonna roll off the end and go. <laughs> I love that. I love the ability to do that. Oh my god. I wish I had like a just a controller with a ton of dials that I could assign things to and it would be super accurate, but I don't and I have yet to find one. <laughs> That's in a good price, I should say. Oh, that is so easy to control. So easy. It's so beautiful. There you go, and we're landed. Oh, that is wonderful. And we're just gonna fold it on up. Everything gets packed away into its own places. Even spinning, it has enough area to actually not come in contact with anything else. So it would be safe indeed to do so in case your propeller blades were stuck spinning. That's one of the safety catches I threw in. It's one of those mental safety catches. So we can actually now turn off our RPM torque and play you one more time. And you can see right here, everything goes over under the secure plates and then comes right back out. And I really hope you guys are enjoying that. I'm gonna do it one more time just to compress it all because I really enjoy how that works. Everything folds down. I'm trying to do minimal, minimal uh, overlap and everything just kind of folds into place into a nice simple rover so if you like what you're seeing hit that like button drop me in the comment let me know what you think and i hope you guys have enjoyed this video for now uh as you've been your boy Jatwa, and i'm gonna get on out of here subscribe if you have not already drop in a like let me know what you think let me know what you guys would like to see next if you're enjoying our seven days to die streams definitely let me know i uh, have some more planned I am actually really enjoying that game now for some reason. Uh, if there's any other games that you think we should play uh, on our um, on our streams, definitely let me know. We usually try to find some good uh, survival crafting games. Those are really fun to do as a stream. And uh, other than that, I'll catch you guys in the next video. For now, it's your boy Jatuan. I'm out of here. Peace. Ring that bell button, I guess people say. I don't know. Don't ring the bell button. Don't, don't ring the, del, the, the bell button. I don't care about the bell button. Subscribe and join our happy gaming family because it's been 2020. You need more gaming happiness. And we are here as a gaming family to offer that to you.